so it's the next day and today I plan on working on getting the brake booster off and the clutch assembly. So I got the clutch master out finally. I got the fuse box out. I got all these wires thrown to the side. I took out the lines out of this um, brake booster. All right, so right now I'm taking off the brake booster. I already got the master off and it's behind the steering column. Or not steering column, but the like steering shaft or whatever you want to call it. I ended up getting those bolts out. There's just four bolts in this little pin right here that holds that mass, that uh, brake booster. I think tomorrow I'll probably get started on sanding this thing down. What up guys, so today I'm sanding the engine bay down. I finally got a drill that I can finally use the wire wheel. Right now the, the homie Jimmy is scuffing up the surface a little bit. Get a couple of time lapses for you guys, show you how far along I get, and we'll see how it goes. What's up, guys? So it's day three of seven. So my GoPro died, but I ended up getting the whole engine bay done. So I'm back at it again. I got started on this front radiator support, but I got this tool, so I'm gonna cut this hard line out and just put a filter right here. So I'm gonna do that real quick. I got it all sanded down. Finally, after like three days of doing it after work, got it all sanded down for the most part. So now I just need to rinse it, clean it up, degrease it all, and then see what else I can sand down or touch up. And then from there, we'll, we'll start prepping it for primer and paint. But there she is, all done. Got the car outside. My camera died again, so just went with the phone, but it'll work for now. I just gotta get this bad boy cleaned up and then I'll throw it in the garage. Okay, so I got it finished, got it all scrubbed down. I'm gonna let it outside for like 20 minutes or 30 minutes, let it dry up because it's super hot out here today. And then I'm gonna throw it in the garage and start 